Contact the Admiral. Yes, Commander. And the message? The fleet's location is still safe. Today, the Rebellion dies. Who is Iden Versio, and why should you care about her? Well, she is an Imperial Commander and the main character in the campaign of Star Wars Battlefront 2. I'm going to tell you more about Aiden, but first be sure to subscribe to GameSpot Universe for a lot more Star Wars videos coming your way, plus videos on the Punisher and Justice League. Now let's jump into Aiden's origin story and find out how she became commander of the infamous Inferno Squad. Aiden Versio is the daughter of Garrick Versio, an admiral of the Galactic Empire who worked for the Imperial Security Bureau which almost makes him sound a little bit like a space accountant. He's also the guy responsible for bringing the Versio home planet of Vardos into the Empire. Aiden's parents divorced when she was five years old, and Aiden went on to be raised under the tutelage of her father. Her father believed that the Empire's strength was necessary to maintain order in the galaxy, thus putting Aiden through intense training and testing her limits beginning at a young age. He molded Aiden into a true believer of the Empire, opposing all that disagree with the Empire's beliefs. Aiden graduated from the Imperial Academy on Coruscant, and with a quick rise in rank, she became commander of Inferno Squad while also being its youngest member. The Inferno Squad is an Imperial Special Forces unit that was formed in response to the destruction of the first Death Star. It is comprised of an elite team that are equally skilled as soldiers and starfighter pilots. Basically, they're the SAS in space. The squad have been involved in some of the key battles from among the Star Wars timeline most notably the battles of Endor and Yavin. But their very first mission was to hunt down and eradicate the Dreamers, an extremist group that splintered off from Saw Gerrera's forces shortly after he got obliterated on Jeddah. The details of that particular mission are laid out in the Battlefront 2 tie-in novel Inferno Squad, which details the origins of the titular team, but more on that in just a moment. Naturally, being the commander of a group of highly skilled soldiers, Aiden is somewhat of a badass herself. In Battlefront 2, she has some pretty unique abilities. Chief among them is this little fella. This assault droid can be controlled and has the ability to stun enemies and create a protective shield around Aiden. She also has a whole arsenal of other abilities at her disposal, from turrets to rocket launchers to barrages of impact grenades. Not only is she a skilled marksman and capable soldier, but she's also an expert fighter pilot. Fun fact, Aiden Versio is reportedly the TIE fighter pilot that takes down Red 4 in the Battle of Yavin. We know this because the sequence is described beat for beat in the tie novel, which granted isn't a given, but this passage is so close to describing the exact sequence where Redfall gets shot down that we've got to believe it. It's actually this tie novel that serves as Iden Versio's debut to the Star Wars universe. Serving as a prelude to Battlefront 2, Inferno Squad delves back into the history of Iden Versio. Similar to the game, it's all written from the perspective of the Empire, treating the destruction of the Death Star as a tragedy and painting the Rebel Alliance as heartless terrorists. Obviously, Aiden's first physical appearance, though, is in Battlefront 2, where she takes the role of the chief protagonist. You play as Aiden as she follows the late Emperor's last orders to destroy the Rebel Alliance. In the story campaign, Aiden and the rest of Inferno Squad witnessed the destruction of the second Death Star during the Battle of Endor. Aiden regroups with her father back aboard the Star Destroyer Eviscerator, where she's given new orders from the now deceased Emperor Palpatine, who's looking pretty decent for a dead guy in some snazzy red robes. It's from this point that Aiden's journey in Battlefront 2 really begins, but we won't get into that here for fear of spoilers. So that was just a quick look into the backstory of the character of Aiden Versio. If you want more Star Wars stuff, then make sure you subscribe buttons over there, I think. We're going to be doing a lot more videos in the lead up to The Last Jedi. If you enjoyed, leave us a comment, like the video, and live long and, no, uh, force? May the force be with you. May the force be with you. Just edit that middle bit out.